set. Welcome back to another one, y'all. Today's gonna be a lot of fun. Uh, it's already been a lot of fun. My truck was really clean before this little adventure. This all happened in the last two miles. These tires sticking out. Boy, howdy, I don't know about it. Y'all have to let me know. Do I get fender flares? If, I don't really like fender flares. I think it'll make the truck look different, but I almost think I need to get those and mud flaps. For the old diesel rig. Yeah, the unit's completely mud covered too. This is my stallion today. Uh, I don't have a running quad anymore. Mine really just crapped out on me a little while back. Probably, well, it was at the beginning of the season. And look who we got. We got old Fred taking him a leak. He needs some exercise, as you can tell. Fred here. He, here, heel. Set. He has gotten fat. I mean... That boy, right there, that's a thick boy. But uh, we're sitting there today. Good property, we're at P. Diddy's place. You guys have been here with me a long time ago. <laughs> Them damn tires, man. I'm surprised I didn't knock the windshield out or crack the windshield. I know, rocks flying out. We had there. meteors coming down of just mud. <laughs> uh, my sunroof might be cracked, but this is the, uh, these are the wagons today. Give everybody the rundown. We're gonna find some sheds today. We're gonna walk this first part because it's a big ridge. And there's a lot of uh, ups and downs and hills and rocks and stuff. So we're gonna break these out later to cover some of the pasture ground. Uh, do you think I'll make it on Harper's rig? Oh yeah. Think it'll do it? Yeah, that's a beast right there. It actually didn't get nearly as many as I thought it yeah. would behind the truck. I think it's just the right yeah. <laughs> being, it is. Look, yeah. it all goes didn't here. didn't that much either. Yeah, that ain't bad. I was hoping I'd have to explain it to the wife in Harper Land. This is Harper's quad. It's her new Can Am 90 that I bought her, and it's all that daddy's got. I need to go buy, I'm thinking about going and buying a new. Yeah. We need a four, four by four for stuff like this. Yeah. Quad. Yeah, put that other one on Facebook and get another one. Yeah, I could. Anyways, let's get at it. I'm gonna run the GoPro today. Shed hunting, you brought, what'd you bring? What is that gun, an AR? Yeah. A two two? Yeah, in case we see some coyotes, uh, some dillers. Two, is it a two two three? Yeah, two two three. <laughs> and I got the sidearm today. Oh, armadillo time! It's a little chilly. They they may not be out today. Uh, I'm thinking about wielding a shotgun in case I see a anything that's legal to shoot. But let's go. Fred, you gonna help me? Huh? Well, Gerald, Gerald's already one up. He started out and literally went probably 200 yards, bam, not even 100 yards and found one. But this is what we're in today. Walking through the thick of it here, trying to find me a good trail. See, you got some good prints through here. I need to see one on the ground so I kind of get my eye adjusted to it. I think that's what I need. Fred is actually absolutely just smashing around, just crazy, crazy dog. He needs it, that dog has needed to get out and uh, get some exercise first of all because he's getting fat but he's just missed hunting and working red here he's running around like a crazy man here come on man you gotta help me find a shed dude plus i need to find a shed so he can put it in his mouth and smell it that, that way he might help me yep just calm down heel heel we're gonna do a bunch of stuff. I brought the 12 volt Traeger today. I got a little adapter that actually uh, you hook alligator clips to your battery and then it converts it into 110. And I have a little portable Traeger Ranger that we're using today. Big shout out to Traeger. Uh, they hooked it up with the grill and it's a bad little dude. I got steaks to cook, uh, sausage. It's gonna be a fun day. Little creek, looking for sheds. Happy dog. Look how happy that dog is. Good day in Kansas. Wanted to warn y'all, uh, by the time, well, in what, two weeks from this video? Two weeks from today, 
we're going to South Dakota. Snow goose hunting with flatland flyaways and pit blinds, big water sets. You're talking 5,000 decoy permanent pit blind. Just unreal, you guys cannot miss it. On top of that, while we're in the intro still here and trying to find our first shed, mind you, we should find a bunch today. Like, we should find a bunch. So, fingers crossed there. Second thing is, I'm giving away two hunts over on my podcast. You have to be uh, subscribed and you gotta go join the podcast to have the chance to win these, but the first one will give away probably beginning of July or middle of June, Alaska. Fully paid trip to Alaska for two of y'all. Uh, me and P. Diddy will be uh, with you. First time I'm ever got the, I've ever got the chance to go to Alaska. Brant, some sea ducks, some widgeon, some mallard, a lot of brown ducks during that time, but the Brant. The Brant, uh, there's a 10% are tarsaled and ban or banded. Uh, not all are tar tarsaled, just say 10% is banded. Y'all wanna get on, get in on that giveaway, first of all. Second of all, we're giving away a two-man uh, sandhill hunt here at the lodge, and you are actually gonna be hunting out here a little bit, uh, where we're at right now for ducks. Uh, two-man for this coming season as well. The Alaska one, that hunt will be at the end of September. So like September 20th, around there, that, oh, oh, that feel good for it. It's a little chilly out today. Oh, that a dog. He's loving it. So yeah, two hunts this season. Uh, that one, that giveaway will happen roughly, I would say, first of September because that hunt won't be until probably November, December, January. So get in on it. The podcast is popping. The podcast, I just did a video. Uh, the reason why I don't collaborate with other duck hunting YouTube channels. Uh, the podcast is a place that I can be myself and talk about stuff like that that I don't necessarily want to address on the channel. And yes, it costs five bucks a month, and I'm sorry if you don't like it. You don't have to, you don't have to join it, you know. What'd you find? Oh, you found a bone. There you go, buddy. Maybe you'll help us out by smelling it. I'll, I'll keep it so I can play fetch with him at least. Preston found one, he hasn't picked it up yet. Come on, Frederick. What'd you find? This is unreal, unreal down here. So many little creeks. Beautiful. I bet those bones belong to this here. You think so? Oh yeah, a whole dead head. I already see him. Dang. That's awesome. Dude, look how much yeah. it's been eaten. Oh by mice. Wow. Look, it's like eaten? Yeah, mice did that? Yeah. That's crazy. Completely ate it off like that. Look at that. Dang. The mice don't play around, Jack. Well, that's cool. That's real cool still. Not really a keeper of any sort, but we'll keep it. All right, now I got an eye for it now. Should stick out. Oh my. I've been walking this damn, I've been on the side of this ridge. Found two, oh my, look at that one. Oh, it is fresh. Yeah. You smell it? And then, and then that one there, look at that. I think this one died while it was in velvet yeah. still. You see how it's like palmated and... Yeah, it's like... It's brittle. Really brittle. Huh, and you can tell. Yeah, you can kind of see it on there. Holy cow, that one's... Let me see that guy. Wow, look at that. Dude, right beside each other? All of them, right along the creek. Look at that beauty. They all went and died by water. How big do you think that guy is? He's broken off right there. I don't know. God, he stinks. 130. Fresh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Aye, aye, aye. He's, yep. Well, you going to make a pile or carry him the whole way? I don't think I'm dropping a pin here and walking back to it. I guess Want I could have Want me to carry yeah. something? Want the ugly ones? Yeah, I'll take the ugly ones. <laughs> think that's the spot down there where you're at along that creek, or does it, it end? It's thick. Oh, it does. It's thick now. I, I think we'll come back down up here. Gotcha. I know it opens up up here. Dude, I've had, I have to get used to walking on these rocks, dude. If you're not paying attention to where you step, dude, you're just stumbling nonstop. And fail yourself with a deer antler? Oh my god, that's not cool. I guess that could happen, huh? Yeah. Ugh. I'll be darn. Well, this is cool. We are. Hell, we've only been, what, at it? Oh, nice spot. Tim, Com matches. 
<laughs> Look at you. You got the eyes, son. Oh, they're not matches. No, they're not. They dropped that close, though. Wow. I wonder how Gerald's doing. Have we went a mile yet? No. It's only been 20 minutes. Dude, you got an eye. I didn't see that. How are you spotting them like that? I don't know. The white, it I guess. It was just sticking right up. Huh. Dude, you're a master out here. You've been doing this since you're a kid. <laughs> yeah. Holy. All right, well, we're really on the board. Why is there so many deadheads down here? Up no against idea. this one creek. No. Look at this one. This one's fresh. Well, yeah, it's fresh. Yeah, it's fresh, but he's been picked over yeah, pretty yeah. quick. God, it stinks all. Yeah, it's been picked over. Look at the back of the antler there. Boom. Yeah. Mice. Yeah. Think it's all mice? Yeah, field field mice. Guaranteed? Rats. Yeah. That ain't a coyote gnawing like that? No. They do it for the calcium, I'm pretty sure. Oh. Well, there we go. Holy cow. One, two, what? One, two, four dead heads and two sheds. Holy smoke. What? Yeah, I wonder what Gerald has. No. <laughs> uh, this is the first property that of Preston's that were going on. This is all of his dad's property. Uh, big shout out to dad. Dang it for letting us come out here and collect. It's awesome. Beautiful. Absolutely. Check it out. Just like when I say beautiful, it's absolutely gorgeous. So I think we're going to we're going to run into a feeder here. Yeah. Let's uh let's drop these by the feeder. Okay. It should be up here a little bit, but drop them, we'll pick them up later so we don't have to carry them. Yeah. Yes. Found one. I'm not going to go shouting to the hills. Check it out. This is where she lay. I'm up against this creek still. This is it's like an old, I don't know. Look at that. That's how she lays on the log. That's nice. That's got some girth to it. Look at that bad boy. Wow. Ha ha ha. Again, gnawed off. Was going to be a really good looking shed until it got gnawed off by these mice. There we go. On the board, baby. We got a lot going on. We've only been at this an hour. And I can only imagine what Gerald has too. This is crazy awesome. <laughs> well, this is what we got so far. Just me and Preston. Who knows what Gerald has still. He found one right off the bat. Yeah, I'm sure he's got a few. Just found this one. Literally 50 yards that way. This guy broken off and got a lot of mass to him though. This is awesome. You weren't kidding, dude. I know. We only been out in an hour, maybe? Yeah, an hour. What time is it? I'm gonna look at my... An hour, we, we probably started right at, right at 10-ish. Yeah. Right now, or I 11. haven't even done a mile since I turned on my Onyx uh, tracker, foot tracker. So we haven't went more than like a mile and a half total. Yeah. Crazy. Where are you at? Wander around aimlessly. <laughs> Wandering and Have you found anything else? Uh, yeah. You get some good stuff? Oh, one cool one. It's all heating up, it's old, nothing fresh yet. I'll be dead gum. Where are you guys at? I can share a waypoint on Onyx with you if you want to do that. Yeah, do that. Right on. All right. Bye. Big shout out to uh, Onyx. Been using them for years. Literally the best app I've ever used. Uh, you can add waypoints and uh, all kinds of stuff. Where you're at. You can share it with your buddy so they can come right to you. And now I just text my location directly to Gerald. And he'll see exactly where I am and come right to us. Onyx is awesome. Uh, gonna be working with Onyx a lot this year. I'm really excited about the partnership because it's been my go-to tool, like our group's go-to tool for guide season every, every day of hunting, literally. We use it all the time, don't we, Frederick? Sit. What is going on with this deer? What are you doing? Preston! There's a deer! I'm 10 foot from a live deer! Sit. Oh look, he's wounded or something. Come here! What is he doing? Sit. 
I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what's happening right now. I'm just right here. It hasn't stopped looking down river. Sit. Yeah, he doesn't care about me. He's worried about, there he goes, sit. Sit. What just happened? What in the actual just happened? Yeah. Fred, don't think about chasing him. Sit. Fred did good. I told him to sit. Dude. <laughs> Dude that, was cool. that was insane. Wow. Well. Holy moly, man. Dude, he was hurt. So his chest right here, I zoomed in on, on my phone. He was like hurt. It was like a deep, deep scrape. It wasn't flapped open, but like deep scrape. It was a buck. He had little black nubs on him. Well, Frederick, I don't know what to tell you, bud. That got crazy. What just happened? Y'all got to drop a comment down below. That was the craziest thing I've ever seen. One of the craziest experiences I've ever had. That was awesome. Smash the thumbs up button, y'all. <laughs> Come on. Well, wow. That was pretty crazy. I've never, yeah, look, he left some fur down there. When they're dying, they come and lay by water. Along the water. What in the world? He was hurt. Sit. Sit, Fred. Good dog. Look, here's a bunch of deer. Here's a lot of his hair down here, though, on the, on the bank. In the water. I'm trying to look for tracks. Like dog tracks. Look at that. Pad one, two, three, four. You have to come look. Unreal. What happened, y'all? I think he got attacked right here or something. And then he was probably in shock for a while and just standing there in the water. And the dog was probably here trying to get him on the bank, I would imagine. Something along those lines. I can't believe you kept walking to him. Yeah. Dude, he, the fact that Come he, down here. Look, look at these, what's it, these tracks? The fact that he didn't care about you. Yeah. And was watching me the whole time. Dude, I know. I crested the hill like you just did, and I just kept coming it's slow. It's almost like Fred made him comfortable. Yeah, him. Fred might have made him comfortable. Huh. He probably yeah. smelt Fred over me. Or he was used to a dog being around. Look, Fred has not been down here. Look at that. Yeah. That's a dog, right? Am I stupid? Or coyote. Yeah, look right here. That right there, is that a coyote track, y'all? You tell me. I'm not good on tracks. I guarantee you when I put that clip on my phone, this clip right here, check it out. It's gonna go crazy. Which one? Oh. On my phone. Oh, we just have Yeah. What do you think that, what do you think the deal was? It's almost like he maybe impaled himself, ran into a tree or something. I wasn't that close enough to see. Was it, it a did, long it, scrape? It looked it? like a barbed wire scrape or I don't know. Wild. That was insane. You all have to drop a comment down below and let us know what you think. There's dog tracks right there on the bank. Were, do you think there were coyote tracks? Uh huh. You think it was? Yeah. Probably smelt him, came to him, couldn't get him because he was in the water hiding from him. I don't know. Fetch up, Hell. fetch up, Fred. Look at this. We just found one right by the feeder. Oh, look, Spike. Spike. Another one. I think I saw one in there, too. Look at this. It's where she lays. Awesome. <laughs> this is cool, man. Well, I tried sending Fred on the antler. On the antler that's over there, Preston's trying not to get wet. Uh-oh. He's, he's definitely going to take on some water at some point here, but it's cold. Real cold. Good. <laughs> you had a standstill? Well, you should have just, yeah, took your boots off and said forget it, and so you don't get the inside of your boot wet. Oh, boy. I literally brought extra socks at the back of the truck. Well, take your boots off. In the while you're in. I'm going to. I'm getting the more shallow stuff. This might get interesting. 
Yeah, just throw them up here. Throw them way up there. Oh, God. With the sock. <laughs> oh, God, it's cold. <laughs> that was cold. <laughs> Don't get your socks wet, son. Don't get... I should have just done this in the first place. He's gonna fall. <laughs> He's gonna fall. Look at girl. He's loving it. It's cold. Well, I wish I would have wore my uh, towel. Oh God, my boot almost went down straight. It's gonna get good. This is going to get good. Oh, oh nice. Smokes, I was walking, all I hear is bang, bang. Freaking pressed and whipped out the nine and went hammer town. So before we came, they have a uh, an armadillo roundup every year out here. They call it Armadillo Armageddon. And uh, Armadillo in Kansas, I don't know about your state, you'll have to check before you go spraying and praying on them. But they're a nuisance and they're invasive, just like pigeons are. Where's he at? Is he tore up? No. Dumped five rounds in the guy. Well, his oh, first God. shot, I skimmed the side of him and then he went and climbed under somewhere, got him again, then he ran straight at me, so I shot two more at him. So armadillo, nuisance. They dig holes. We have we have clients at Flint Oak all the time. Step in a hole, roll their ankle. It's bad. It's getting wild out here, y'all. Getting western. Holes pressed and spray. That was like not 10 seconds ago, you were like, the dead one right here. Yeah. Then I saw that one, and then there were a bunch of turkey here too. One. It's been a little bit, but check it out. Uh, that sucker has been completely chewed down. We'll show the boys, but not a not a keeper there. I'll get you a drink, bud. Ed just took off on me on a scent. I let him go kind of run around and play a little bit. That sucker was gone for five minutes. I'm sitting here going, Fred here. Yeah, he, uh, he's just having fun. But now, look at him. He got in trouble. Fred, right here. He heal. Look, he knows. He's like, okay, dad. Come on, let's go. Barely spotted this one. Barely. Check this out. Right there, not sticking up at all. Oh yeah, been there for a little bit. Been there for a lot of bit. All the way underneath the grass. <laughs> this is awesome, man. Good success today. We're already probably. I bet we're 20 in. I bet we got 20. Uh, going well. Well, just found <laughs> this beauty. Oh yeah. So I got these three, and check it out what I just spotted. I'm on my way back to the truck. Come on, right here. Look at this one. Ooh, it's nice. Not real nice. There we go. Pick this bad boy up. Ha-ha! What in the world? Look at that. Dead head. Look at that side, though. That's an odd-looking antler right there, no? On one side, huh? They're back. Geez, look at this. This is what we found on the way back. Mind you, we still got the pile at the old uh, at the old deer blind. We gotta go get. What up? Nothing. What are you doing? Did you find any more? Yeah. Look at that odd one. Oh, whoa. Yeah. That's an old one. I wonder if they have pictures of him. I don't know. He's odd enough, you'd think. They would recognize him. Yeah. Look at this odd one. You guys ever get pictures of one like that? <laughs> Dude, Preston, if you were a deer, <laughs> you would be this wow. deer. Look at that. So the pond... I wonder pond, if dad has any pictures like I him. I bet he does. Isn't that cool? I came up on him, I'm like, what in the world? Oh, you got those we on did the... did like a little 10 minute little... On the quad? Yeah, that's way better. Oh, that's nice. Dude, we have found a ton. We yeah, to be close to 30 shots. Oh, we got over those 30. over there. We're, we're over 30. Over 30 already? With deadheads, yeah. Crazy. That's awesome. That's real awesome. <laughs> Let's roll her, boys. <laughs> oh, the old girl. She's a Willian machine. Well, I left Gerald and Fred in the truck. We're going to go make a run on the quads real quick. Gerald's got to charge his phone. Uh, thank goodness for OnX, to be honest with you. If I hadn't have had it, 
uh, I was almost lost on a, a big old 500 acre patch. Crazy. Oh boy. Get squirrely. <laughs> oh, she's eating today, boys. All right. Oh no. Think they'll ride? I think so. There we go. Came in. It'd be a tragedy if one just went over the. Oh, I, I know. One, especially that tire. good. Especially that good deadhead. Well, yeah, we definitely have over 30 of them. Oh boy, Frederick. Oh, we're out on the mini quad. We're way, way deep in a whole new set of woods on top of a big dam here. I gotta cross this bad boy. Barely made it up that bad boy. Oh yeah, she's a trooper, boys. Easy. Yeah. Valley, surrounded by entire hill system and trees. Oh yeah, we got big success. This looks like a huge bedding area. All of it's pushed down and look, there's one. Look at that. Deer poop right by it. Look at that. Then I looked over. This might be a matching pair. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> That's a matching pair, boys and gals. <laughs> Look at that. First ones of the day. Matching pair. Yeah, buddy, first matching pair of the day. Matching. Oh, no way. Yeah, hold them up. Right next to each other? Oh, look, one was literally right there and then in front of the quad. That's awesome. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Sweet. Yeah. Finally. Dude, we've been trucking around. This is a big bedding area down in this valley. Uh -huh. I mean, all of this grass is shoved down. I'm going to troll around it a little bit more. Frederick really put on the miles today. I don't know. I guess, I'm guessing he put on every bit of 10-ish miles in total. You put on what? I hit seven, so Fred's like 20. Yeah. Guaranteed. Good exercise. <laughs> this situation here. Ooh. Ooh. A lot of power washing to do, but like Geralt, you, like you just said, crazy day. That's some. That's more sheds that's, than you found in five years. Yeah, for sure. That's crazy. Easy. Usually we just find them turkey hunting. Yeah. We found like five or six turkey hunting last yep. year. Well, now we know where to go waste our time yeah. doing this. Look at that P. Diddy. Look, he's loving it. Absolutely insane. Three guys. I don't know. What, three watt, three different, how many different fields? Three? Well, it's just one property. Yeah. So it's I'm, one huge, pr yeah, it's I one bet, huge. I bet we, I, I bet we covered a tenth. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight dead heads, which there's only two fresh ones. One's there, and then just an array of different sizes. A lot of them being the same-ish size, you know. But one pair that we found at the end there on the little quad. Uh, this is what we got going now. That was all in how many hours? Like four maybe total? Four or five. Five hours. I think we started at 11, and it's four o'clock. So, so yeah, yeah, probably four, four or five. Probably hours. four hours of actually looking. We got the Traeger going, like I promised. She's a mud bug, like anything. We've been using the duck seasoning out here. Uh huh. A little treat. A little treat. We about to eat. That's good. Yeah, really good. The steak, awesome. Mm. Oh yeah. Mmm. Good seasoning, good. Just throw it on there. Finger eating. It's hot. A little bit of smoked sausage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We got the uh, turkey winners coming. I'm ready. The They're 15th. gonna be hunting right here. Yeah, probably right here. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of birds. Yeah, it'll be so fun. It will be fun. I'm glad to. It'll be fun having just people in and out. Yeah. Everybody's Two guys at a time to go take uh -huh. turkey hunting with shotguns. Yeah. They're not doing bow, which is nice because we'll be able to get them more opportunities, you know. But I hope you guys like today's video is a little different um, A lot different. It's gonna be off season a lot of camping a lot of fishing coming I uh, got a lot of things uh, new camper. There, there's so much stuff coming y'all's way. Well, you got to stay tuned and the South Dakota snow goose hunts are coming
the giveaway. And the giveaways. Like I said, I said at the beginning of the video, we're giving away an Alaskan hunt for two for September. It'll be now, I do know, September 18th through the 25th. It is my birthday. That, that, that's my birthday week. So my birthday is the 21st. You guys have to so, shoot something cool. Yeah. Though. You gonna fly Fred out there? Fred can't go. I ain't taking him to no ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him, he ain't no ocean dog.